Hi there, this is Martin Chuck, and I want to show you a pretty slick little product called the Three Bays GSA, or Golf Swing Analyzer. You know, there's a lot of products on the market right now that attach to your golf club, but I think this one's pretty much the coolest one, and the one that you're going to feel the least well on your golf club. So, pretty slick packaging. You know, not that a package is why you should buy something like this, but let's take a look. You know, when you open it up, it's got your charger, your cable to attach to your computer if need be, the directions, a uh, handy dandy little carry case. There's basically the packaging on the inside, and of course, this little guy, the unit itself. And you can see it's kind of got a T on the end, or that looks like it, actually a big T to begin with. And the way it works, it's pretty simple. You pop it in the end of a golf club, which we're going to do outside here in just a moment, and take some data and see how we do. Right now I'm just turning it on. You can see it kind of lit up nice and blue right there. And we're going to pair this to my phone. You see this little guy that is put into the butt of my 8-iron here it is a tiny little few grams of weight right here and it pops into the golf club. And then you align it in such a way that there's a tiny little arrow on here to kind of get you square to the grooves. And then you sync it to your phone. There's a free app on either iPhone or Android market. And it's ready for me to go. I've selected 8-iron. I'm going to hit a few shots. And I'm going to test this with my TrackMan inside here to see what kind of, uh, how these numbers match up to that really expensive piece of hardware that I use when I teach. So I've got the analyzer right here. I'm going to set this down. And I'm going to hit a little 8-iron. And I'll hit a variety of shots here to see how this does. So I'm waiting for this little blue signal. It's on. It's ready to capture data and transmit it. So let's hit a little shot here. Nice crisp strike. Felt pretty good. And it says one swing to review. The golf swing analyzer is ready to go. And the company's called Three Bays. That's the number three spell. And then the letter, letters B-A-Y-S, Three Bays. Good solid strike and it's transmitting data. So I'm going to stop here for just a moment. It says two swings are now ready for view. And I'll walk over to the camera here and we'll do a little up close on what I'm looking at. So you can see on my phone right there it says two swings were transmitted to the phone. Let's go ahead and view it now and see what we see. So there's a face on person right there and we can go ahead and toggle back and forth to watch the path and like most players it's a little wider going back and a little bit more narrow going down because I still have some wrist hinge in there and then we can look at some of the data there we go we swipe it up and we've got club head speed numbers now that club head speed right there 80 miles an hour and it says carry number 148 yards and that's pretty much a stock 8 iron for me now it says club face angle open and swing path square. So for those of you that are trying to hit the correct draw, you really need a club face that's a little bit open to the target line to start the ball to the right and that path can curve the ball back to the left. So let's come back in here and look at some more of this data here. Um, it's probably tough to see in the camera, but a lot of neat stuff here. Consistency, we've got a tempo number 3.2 to 1. That's really important to me. It's got, it measures your backswing time to your downswing time, carry distance, ball speed. And we're going to go and check and see if this, and here's my down the line look here. I can play that and I can slow-mo to see what my club path looks like. And just for fun, let's go ahead and take a really, really goofy one, see how that looks. The three bays analyzer is ready to go. So let's hit a shot and let's have a really, really outside in path, excessively outside in. There we go, that was a doozy. And it's, the data is being collected by the phone here. Let's take a look. Let's view it, I'm afraid to look. But if you check, if I come back to this one, which is completely different looking than the previous, you can see how this was a much more inside path 
and then there's a very much very much over the top very very different from my previous path which was matched up pretty well so I'm actually very surprised at how accurate this little device is for the expense so really really neat information here let's come back to the we had 72 miles an hour right there in that way over the top speed we had a carry distance of 132 which was as an example you know 18 yards shorter than the previous shot the the tempo is way different 2.6 to 1 rather than my 3 to 1 which I, I really like uh, face angle said it was square and path outside in for those of you out there in the know that's pretty much the slice and that's the shot I hit out there let's do a down the line view of a couple of swings alright let's hit a couple of stock 8 iron shots here the GSA is ready to go the transmitter is blue ready to be to send information to the phone let's go ahead and hit one good solid strike and sure enough the data was sent to the phone and let's take a look press view it now and once again I can come to the phone and we can look at this path right here together and compared to that last one let's go ahead and hit press play and I can toggle this back and forth and you can see that the downswing path and the backswing path mirror each other pretty darn close compared to that last over the top swing that I made now we can come back and look at the, the data more specifically. We've got a club head speed number in there of 81 miles an hour. The tempo back to a 3 to 1 right there, which I really like. Uh, carry distance 150 yards. And an open face again to a square path. Okay, I know I'm in the dark here, but I'm in my studio here at the Raven. And we're going to hit a little shot. I've got an 8 iron out and the GSA is engaged. Let's go ahead and compare it to TrackMan. Get a pretty solid shot there. Uh, club head speed of my 8 iron is 84 miles an hour on TrackMan, carried at 148. Uh, let's see, the attack angle down 5 degrees, swing direction 1 degree, Called path a little positive, face path a little close, so baby draw there. So we're going to take a look at what we see on the GSA. So I click process and I'm looking at it right now so we can compare those numbers. So we've got, uh, this has 80 miles an hour club head speed on it. Not too bad. We had 84 miles, 83.9. Let's take a look at some of the data. We've got um, ball speed carry distance. Carry distance 148 yards on TrackMan, 148 yards. Pretty darn nice. The interesting thing, it says face angle open. Now to hit a draw, a, a correct draw, my face angle is open on TrackMan. And I could, let me put this on a different screen and show you these details. So I apologize if this is a little bit fuzzy, but you can see my attack angle on TrackMan and what we got here on the GSA. Pretty amazing stuff how 148 yards, 148 yards. Ball speed I don't have up here on TrackMan. But uh, what's really nice is the tempo. You know, I've got, there's some tempo features on this that are great that I really am a big fan of. My tempo, 3 to 1. If you're a tour tempo fan, that's kind of what you're looking for. So. Let's uh, hit a few shots outside. The path and the face aren't quite as technical or as, as accurate as a TrackMan, obviously, but you can see that there's a lot of valuable data in a small, inexpensive machine that is, you, you can't even feel it on the golf club. So if you're in the market for a great swing analyzer, the Three Bays GSA is fantastic. And best of all, I'm giving one away for free. All you have to do is like my Facebook page and the Three Bays Facebook page. Pretty darn easy and you can win one. I'm going to be giving this away on Christmas Day. So this is a contest that's going to be a short time and somebody's going to win one of these cool little devices. So this is Martin Chuck from the Raven Golf Club Phoenix. I hope you win this great little swing analyzer. Thanks for watching.